A couple of weeks back, the NCAA canceled all spring activities, including spring football, leaving many athletes to wonder where they could continue to stay in shape. Well, Greg Beasley has more on a trio of Bison football players from Dickinson who took matters into their own hands. The Bison are coming off their eighth national title in nine seasons, and a lot of work comes during the offseason in the weight room and during spring football. But this year is different. We first thought, like, nothing's going to happen to us. We'll be fine. And then as more and more schools started to shut down, close down for spring break and stuff, we thought, well, it might happen to us now, too. As NDSU sent their students home, that led to Caden Koontz and the Kubis brothers, Jake and Zach, heading home to Dickinson. Right away, I just came back and I brought stuff for like three weeks because we had the, we originally just were going to be home for two weeks after spring break. But then we got the email we were at home that face to face was canceled for classes. So I had to go up just last weekend to get all my stuff from the dorms and move out. That left the trio asking, where are they going to work out? Enter this machine shop on the Kubus family farm just outside of Dickinson. Usually filled with the noise from tractors is now filled with this. And we knew we had the materials because we had some wood and some materials and concrete around, so we decided to kind of make our own thing. We just went and bought the weights, and so it kind of turned out really nice. We just decided, oh, we need more than just a bar and free weights, and so Caden's dad looked up a video how to build a squat rack on YouTube, and we just went with it, built it, set it up, and then we've just kind of been expanding on it since. The DIY Bison now had themselves a gym and are continuing to build on. Yeah, we just added a lap pull down area yesterday, so I don't know, we'll see where it goes from, from here on. Even though these bison are apart from their teammates, they're still pushing each other as a team. Even if we're not with each other, just push each other through calls, texts, hey, what are you doing today? Are you getting better? You know, just keep pushing each other so we can hit the ground running when we can get back to Fargo and hopefully play football again. And when the Bison do get to go back to Fargo, they hope that the work here in the Machine Shed gym will lead to more cannons and another celebration in January. Reporting in Dickinson, for your news leader, I'm Greg Beasley.